How's it going guys? Sleepy Jim here bringing you a bit of Day Z. This is a special on finding a Ural truck in Day Z. Uh, the first <clears throat> discovery, uh, repairing it, what happened next, and then finally driving it. Ooh. Just look out for zombies. That's Oh, what's that over there? Oh my god, is that a vehicle? Really? I'm not joking, it looks like uh, it's a vehicle. I'm going to scope this out. It's just parked around these trees somewhere. Epic! I can't cheat though and use a car, but we maybe we can store it somewhere off in the woods. Yep. Let's just get the old Enfield out. I hardly ever use these things, but it was my crappiest weapon. Um, yep. Where are you, TJ? Uh, in the woods. There's yeah. like a warehouse building here. I'm coming toward you. Yeah, it's a truck, man. Oh my Is god. It, it looks it looks practically new, but really? it probably has to be repaired. I'm coming toward you. Oh my god, it's one of those epic trucks. Can you see me on the map? I did, but you went away. There's a couple of zombies here. I don't think this is a camp or anything because it's... I think that's a spawn location, but I could be wrong. Which way are you at? Um, I don't know where I am, <laughs> to be honest. I think I'm near... A, I think I'm near that town... Are um, you in the woods? Skalka. I'm in a field... Next to... A large section of woods. If that helps, that pretty much describes almost anywhere in this in this game. Oh my god, that is epic! Oh my Sweet. god! I bet you it looks like it's not missing any wheels or anything. Oh my god, it's a Ural. I'm gonna see what's is it in it. Drivable. Uh. There's some coke in, in here and stuff like that. Um, let's drop that. It's got like 10 cans of coke, five wood piles, and that's it. It's just got like soft drink in it, man. Where is it near? Uh, should barn? I take the Pepsi or the coke, guys? Let's go the coke. Pepsi okay, pretty much lost a barn in, in the like uh, in front of Soda me. Wars. Oh my god, this is epic! Is it drivable? Uh, I'm in it. Um, it's taking its sweet time. I don't know, it's just frozen. Ah! Oh. Yeah, look how much vehicles lag. Lag the server. That's crazy. I'm down to like two frames a second in this thing. Huh. Remember when, uh, remember when we got in the tractor, I think it did this. And the bus was the same, but this thing's just crazy bad. Uh, it looks, it doesn't even got the indicators. Oh, I'm in the wrong seat. I'm in the passenger seat. No wonder. Okay. I just got out. These things you can run over vehicles and it doesn't damage it or anything, apparently. Really? Yeah. That's pretty boss. Um, I'm just going to head around to the driver's side. Actually, it should let me. Are you wow, near look a how road? much lag I'm getting on this. It's like two frames a second, man. Are you near a road? Uh, yeah, right next to the main road, there's a big industrial looking place. And it's yeah. parked under the awning at the at the back, the forest Does it side. Look like it spawned or oh, something. Oh, it's it it's pretty much stuffed, man. It needs heaps of stuff. But um, I'll see if it's drivable. No, it's not drivable. But I'll save it. Okay, I'm um, in a dirt road. I've got some zombies coming. Are you near a dirt road? Where's the save thing? Uh, no, it's the it's the bitumen road. Did you find that yet? Uh-uh. That is epic, man. 
It's a shame we can't hide it somewhere. Where's the save symbol? Come on. Throw me a freaking bone here. I'm just near a bunch of intersections of these dirt roads. Dude, you got a map. You can. You should have no problems knowing exactly where you are. But I don't know where you are. It's not giving me the option to save it. Uh, I don't know where I am either if that makes you feel better. Uh -huh. Oh, here we go. Yeah. And there's another M1911 with two mags. I really want that. Okay, we're and a revolver. And painkiller. Sweet. How did you just hit the jackpot on all this stuff? Seriously. I just joined in the red building where I was hurt at. I just refueled it again. Um, okay, let's save that. And I will get out the other the tires that I've got here. Oh, hang on. I've got another fuel, fuel can. Do they keep spawning them or what? No, um, I think it just refuels one at a time. It's a bit annoying. I'm keeping an eye on the tree line just to make There's sure. There's a zombie spawned in, by the way. Where is it? I don't know. Oh, you can hear it? Yep. What kind of Jim headset do you have? Uh, just some Sennheiser. Oh, those are supposed to be pretty good anyways, the Sennheisers. Yeah, these are pretty nice. I use them at work as well. Um, okay. So, Jim, I saw, that get rid of I saw that tweet that you tweeted a long time ago and you were like, uh, something about when you're looking at some graph, you said, you, and it reminds you of a brownie. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, cool. I'll put tires on it. Then all we need is two tires and an engine block. Okay, and me to get up. Yeah, you should just come back here because there's that pack and stuff y'all can pick up so you can storm Actually, more. this only needs one more tire. That's boss. Yeah, Jim, but you should come back to this town so you can pick up the Alice backpack so you can have more space to store, like, fuel cans. Yeah, we're going to come back when we get morphine, dude. But I meant before you get morphine, because it's on the <laughs> way, like, to wherever you go. Dude, nagging does not make you <laughs> yeah, you more need attractive. To, you need to stop <laughs> nagging, man. It looks like it has all the wheels now. I think it does. Uh, I'm looking on the other side and it's good. It's golden. Hey, hey, um. Well, oh, it might have one flat on this side, yeah. Let me have a look. Um, it's looking a lot better. We just need the engine and one wheel and it's good to go, dude. I'm just gonna turn the lights off and get out and save it. Man, that was awesome. Sweet. Uh, just be. So the other guys eventually had to go, but uh, I soldiered on. And uh, came back eventually with an engine block that I found. And uh, I thought I had a, had a wheel as well. But uh, what it turns out what happened was uh, I didn't have su sufficient space in my backpack to uh, fit the wheel. And when I transferred it from inventory to backpack, the backpack ate the wheel. So I lost it. And I uh, didn't realize that until I got to the truck. So anyway, I get back to the truck here, and uh, I'm just checking out the wheels and stuff like that. And uh, that one at the back there, the back right-hand side one, does look like it's a little bit flat. A few zombies in the area. So I head around the side here and I uh, repair the engine. It's actually only yellow, but uh, wanted to have everything uh, in the green. Okay, so at that point, uh, what I do is I get in the URL after a little bit of uh, fiddling around, looking for the save uh, area. And uh, let's check out what needs repairing at this point. It's just... One of the wheels uh, is in the orange. Everything else is green, fully fueled. Everything's good to go except that one goddamn wheel. So <laughs> I'm pretty annoyed at this point. And uh, 
I'm still still can't believe that I haven't got that wheel on me anywhere. Uh, what this is going to mean, I'm probably going to have to head right back to the Northwest Airfield, uh, to the area there where the industrial buildings are, to try and find another wheel. That's the probably the closest location where I can find one. Uh, and uh, just in case, I have a look around the back of this building as well in a second and just guys check the equipment in the truck here we've got an m16a2 an mp5 sd my favorite gun in the game uh there's a g17 as well um some uh, i think i've got a frag grenade in there and all this other stuff so uh we've stored stored some decent stuff in there at this point in the game now i head back here to see if i can find a tire a couple of zombies get aggroed. Uh, so take one of them out. Uh, but that shed at the back, you can't actually enter it. So you, there's no lootable areas in this building. And I'm, I'm so desperate at this point, I try to drive it with one, uh, one bad tire. But you can see that that doesn't really work out too well for me. It kind of makes the whole truck swing to to one side, so there's no point really trying to drive it um, without getting that extra tire. So I start to head back um, towards the northwest airfield, and uh, just uh, at this point, I get uh, I think a Skype message or something that distracts me for a second here. You hear the indicator in a second. So I'm thinking that I probably should save it as well. Because I've got to save it after I moved it a little bit. So I'll head back over. Do the old save thing. And I decided to take the uh, M16, uh, the the 1911 rather than the G17. If I'm going to go back to the Northwest Airfield, I want to have at least a one-hit kill weapon of some sort here, and that's got more ammo in it as well. I mean, I've got the AKM as well. So we save the URL, then we head back, uh, head back in this direction. Heading towards the Northwest Airfield here. It's a long, long journey on foot as well. And this is the point where I get the Skype message. You can just hear that. So I kind of stop to check that out. And uh, then at this point, something, uh, something pretty strange can be heard approaching in the distance. And uh, you guys will hear this in a second. Yep. It's a vehicle coming coming in this direction. They're headed straight for that URL. So they, these guys knew it was there. In fact, they may have even have been checking it out previously now. All this time that have been at the building repairing it, no one else has been there. Take... Take note of that fact, and I only see one guy jump out of out of their UAZ here. Uh, but at this point here, I think someone's actually shooting at me from it seems like the other side of the main building. Uh, it's really hard to tell, and there's this one guy here as well. So there's no way I'm letting him steal my Euro. Uh, Amazo, I think his name is. So I uh, put him down pretty hard, <laughs> spray a few more bullets than I really needed to into him. He's dead. And there is no one else in the UAZ either. But, yeah, that's what happens next. I get taken out from some guy. I have no idea where that guy was. Uh, if you slow that down and watch it 20 times, if you can tell me where the guy was, uh... Well done, because I could not spot him even playing back that video a few times. But yeah, I got killed. That's not the end though, guys. Part 2 will follow.